Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Kelvin from Make3DComics.com and BlackSunComics.com, and today we'll be discussing how to change skin tone in Daz Studio. Stay tuned. <laughs> So what we're looking at here is a Genesis figure with Legacy Victoria 4 morphs applied to it. If you don't know how to apply Legacy morphs to Genesis, I have a video explaining it. And you can click the link here to check out that video. In the meantime, if you're ready, let's uh, let's continue with how to change the skin tone of this character. It's just the the whatever base texture comes with Victoria 4 is what I've applied to this particular uh, model here. So first things first, I'm going to select the, I find the surface selection tool. There it is. I always get mixed up between this one and uh, the scale tool, but what we want is the surface selection tool. So I'm going to click that. I'm going to come over to my scene tab and make sure that I have Genesis selected. And surfaces tab, that's the next one I'm going to need. So if you're in something else, just go to your surfaces tab. And these are the surfaces that I have. Again, I want to select Genesis. So make sure you have the surfaces for Genesis selected. And this little triangle arrow, or I think it's called a carrot sometimes. Just want to click that. And what I'm going to get is a list of all the surfaces for Genesis. So since I want to change the skin tone, I'm going to select everything that uh, applies to the, the skin. So the, the lips and what I'm doing is just holding down. I'm on a Mac, so I'm holding down the command button. If you're on a PC, I believe you'd hold down the control button and click because I'm going to select multiple things at once. So select the lips, the skin, face, nipples, head, hip, uh, neck, torso, fingernails. I don't need. Uh, the arm, the feet, the forearm, the hand, the legs. Let's see if there's anything else here. No, I don't. Well, maybe I could get the nostrils too. Why not? I'll get the nostrils too. And then what I'm doing is this diffuse color. So you can scroll all the way down. Just make sure you're at the top. And what you want is the diffuse color. So I'm going to change these numbers. And as I change these numbers, you'll notice the skin will change to reflect what's happening here. So I'm going to change this first number to 133. And it doesn't have to be exactly 133. And then 115 for this one. See, it's looking all purple now. One fifteen, and then this last one I'm going to change to ninety five. And actually, I I should explain what I'm doing is I'm clicking and dragging to the to the left, and that's what's changing this number. As far as I know, there's not a way to just double click and enter a number. That that would be easier. Okay, so this one is going to go to ninety five. Now it's a darker skin tone. Let's do a quick spot render just to see what that's going to look like. So I'm going to click my spot render tool and just click and drag and select a portion and see what that's going to look like. Okay. So that's basically how you get darker skin. Now with all that being said, I actually don't recommend the method that I just showed you as the best way to create a melanated texture to get a melanated texture out of your Daz uh, characters. It's more of a workaround. If you really want a quality texture, I, I recommend spending the money and just purchasing one. Uh, you can get one from the Daz store. Here, here's some good ones that I like. There's this Marie texture for Victoria 4. There's also uh, Rob for Michael 4. And this is for Genesis 3 female, uh, Samira. And Darius 6 for Genesis 2 male. So these are some quality textures that you can get. 
uh, for your characters of African descent. And I'd actually recommend going this route. But if you don't have the money, use the method that I just showed you. Feel free to play with those numbers until you get a look that you really like. So thank you for watching. Remember to visit us at blacksuncomics.com where you can download a free preview of our first book, Black Sun, The Longest Night. If you liked what you saw, please click like and subscribe. Check out some of the other videos on this channel for more tutorials about Daz Studio. And until next time, take care. Peace.